much as you probably want, but how good did it feel to start a catcher today? You know, it's just the core group of guys we have behind the plate. It's just something that you don't get a, a lot of times to have that kind of core that we have here. You don't get to have that a lot of different places, you know, when you play. Um, you know, it's, it's just a team thing, man. And uh, the way that we contribute, you know, each guy contributes is all that matters. And uh, obviously it feels good to start, you know, and uh, just kind of get back at home, you know, see the, seeing pitches at home and working with the guys is always, you know, I'm always a pitcher guy. I, wanna, I want my guy to, you know, love, you know, throwing to me. So just try to keep that upbeat energy, man. It just feels good to catch. How'd it feel to not throw the same guy once, but twice in the same game? Uh, it was just more of a, you know, if you've seen the, the pitch location, man, they gave me a chance to throw. And, uh, you know, I, I really thank Coach Walton for taking me. And, uh, you know, I started struggling there at the beginning of spring with, you know, my throwing. And he really, you know, pulled me aside and worked with my, my action, my arm action. And it has changed everything how I throw. And uh, just thank him for seeing that because I would have never seen it. Um, but, man, it just feels good. You know, that's something I struggled with, you know, in the past. And to be able to move forward and that kind of, you know, to have that kind of success with that feels great. Yeah. In the fifth inning, the, that base runner was rounding home and he slipped and you hesitated a little bit. What, what was going through your mind? It was, was it a throw, not to throw? You know, in those type of situations, you've got to have poise. you got to be able to slow the game down at, at that moment. Um, you know, when you see a guy slip, you know, it's an automatic out, right? So i got to slow down. i got to make sure I catch the ball because obviously it was a perfect throw. And it skipped right to my chest. So, you know, just slowing the game down, getting out is the biggest thing. So. What do you think of how Katie's been able to do still offense? You know, I've played, I've seen a lot of players play, and uh, that kid is unbelievable. If you come to practice every day and watch how he just, how he works on his swing, and, you know, what Matt and those guys have, and Josh has done with that kid is just unbelievable. And you don't, you don't see that from a freshman, right? And, you know, and what he's doing is just tremendous to the team, and it's just going to take our team even even further than than what we could think because all those RBIs count, and that's how you win. So unbelievable kid. What do you talk to you? What do you think of Justin this game today? Justin's lights out. If you watch that kid, he's another one with poise as a freshman, just like Trinkle. You know, those guys know how to slow the game down and really just dive into what you know the the, the team feel, right? So. Every at bat, every pitch, he's buying into what's going on, you know, as a whole group. And you know, when you do that, you have a chance to win. And all those guys are team guys, so that's that's the best thing ever. So, how has this transition to a Ball State been for you? You know, it's crazy. I had a, a long ride at this. Uh, it's so long of a story. You'd be here all night. But uh, you know, these guys, especially Josh, fighting for me to get here, and I'm just blessed. I'm thankful that. God gave me another opportunity, and uh, these guys believed in me, and they have just broke me down and built me back up with full confidence, and uh, can't ask for a better coaching staff. I mean, you got, I mean, <laughs> three, all these guys in the dugout that are just by far the best coaches in the country. You see it everywhere on social media. Look who's in the dugout, you know. What those guys do is they come in every day ready to work with us. And that just is what is excelling our game, is just how, how much the coaches really dive into us and pour into us, not just on the field, but off the field.